It was a big day at Petco Park today. Uh, hard to say that in December, but the Padres are making news. Matt Kemp was introduced to the San Diego media, and Mighty 1090 was there to bring it all to you. Appreciate you guys all coming out here today. This is this is a pretty big day for me. Uh, new chapter in my life. I'm really excited about this new opportunity to, to help this organization get back to where it wants to be. One thing about Matt Kemp, he's not the only guy that was is joining the Padres. Is uh, Myers, Will Myers is coming over. Justin Upton for a whole new outfield for the Padres. He calls A.J. Preller, the Padres' new general manager, a rock star. Every day I wake up, there's always a different trade with the Padres. I got an alert on my phone, ESPN. And I, every time I hear the dun and I'm like, what did A.J. do now? You know, it's, he has something up his sleeve. The addition to Kemp could change something that which gets under Padre fan skins to... Uh, to a big degree, that's when the Dodger fans take over Petco Park whenever the Dodgers to come play San Diego. Kemp says that tide is going to switch now. I'm telling all you Padres fans out there, when you play against the Dodgers, man, I need y'all to come out and support. We need, we need, we need pitch blue, not Dodger blue. <laughs> and while Matt Kemp's certainly no stranger to the bright lights of Hollywood and the paparazzi and all that, he lives in the suburbs of San Diego. No, I live in, I live in, I live out here in Poway, so, um, yeah, it's just, it's just where everything just works out for, for, for yeah, yeah, it's close, it's very close. I'm Jay Paris with San Diego Sports Leader, Mighty 1090.